Hi everybody, Kevin from Stingray Biology here. So, um, coming into the shop every day, you never know what you're gonna find. It's always an adventure. Um, it could be something good, it could be something bad. And uh, so when I come in, like I said before many times, I always do my rounds and see what's going on. You know, um, it, I could find pups, I can find dead fish, I can find um, something going wrong with a pump or a filter. Always, there's always something going on. And um, today, I found something, and it's uh, <laughs> interesting and disturbing. Um, you know how I've uh, always said that when the rays shed their stingers, you always got to take it out of your tank immediately, right? Um, and uh, I mentioned it in my dissection video uh, that was posted on the Predatory Fins YouTube channel. Um, I had suspected a ray uh, that wasn't eating, that maybe they swallowed a stinger. Okay, and you know, I'm going to show you guys because I come in today and I find a ray and she's got a stinger stuck in her mouth. Now, I saw this stinger in the tank yesterday and I meant to take it out. And I'm, I'm just like beating myself up because I got too busy and I forgot to pull it out. I come in and I remember today I'm looking for it and I don't find the stinger. Okay, and of course, it's in the fish's mouth. I'm going to show you guys right now. It's that one right there. Okay. Now, just wait for her to come up. Now, I have to figure out a way on how I'm going to remove this stinger. See, it's on the underside, right by her mouth. She must have thought it was food and then just sucked it right in. And it went in point first, right into her mouth. And uh, half of it's sticking out. Oh, come on. Let's see. Let me try to lure her out so you guys can see it. Here we go. Here she comes. And she's acting pretty normal other than I see her lifting a little bit. Can you guys see it? There it is. Uh, all these other rays. I think it's feeding time because I'm standing here. And uh, she's off to the back here. Let me try to come around over here. There we go. See, all the rays are following. Jeez. Let's see. See, she's kind of lifted up there. Here she comes. Let's see. Come on, come on. Don't be shy. Look at that. Can you guys see it? It's like a toothpick sticking out of her mouth. Unreal. Now, I'm going to have to figure out a way on how to remove this thing. It looks painful, right? And uh, the, the area around her mouth is already all red. I have to figure out how am I going to pull this thing out. Look at that, guys. We're going to attempt to pull that out right now. I've got my stuff ready. Uh, I'm going to try to first attempt getting her on the side of the wall and see if I can get underneath there and pull it out. All right? Here we go. <laughs> I'm going to have to think for a bit. And, um, I mean, I've had this happen before, which is why I'm so cautious of something like this happening. Uh, and I mention it all the time and at least this is a bigger stinger you know what I worry the most about are the small stingers that come off pups they're literally t like about an inch and only uh, like a thin like a toothpick so I can only imagine if the ray swallows something like that and it's in their their body in their in their intestines how how on earth am I gonna you know get that out or, or, or fix that problem um, see this at least as long as I figure a way to get underneath the ray I'm probably just gonna yank it right out but with the smaller ones you know that's a nightmare it can be stuck in in their body for their entire lives 
and um, you know when people worry about uh, mysterious death and, and and things like that that's the number one thing I think of you know um, no one wants to think that they're doing something wrong and 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 not keeping the fish properly um, but I'm gonna see what I can do about this and how to help her out as soon as possible all right guys check this out so I was just telling you about you know looking for little stingers right and um, I stopped for, for filming for a second just to finish my rounds and checking all the tanks and speak of the devil look what I find here's this basket you see that little stinger right there now see if I don't remove this right away or if I don't catch it right away when I feed and the rays go nuts look at that see he's already on top of it if he thinks it's food he's gonna just suck it right in so I'm gonna move it right out of the way and and try to get this stinger out of here I'm doing it while filming so it's hard for me to see wow. nope I didn't get it there we go I got it here it is so let me try to get a focus on it anyways so imagine your ray swallowing something like that so this is a very valid concern so for all you guys at home you should always be paying attention checking your tanks looking for these little stingers because it could be the death of your stingray um, and for those of you who have sand or gravel or some kind of substrate that makes it even more difficult for you guys to find it um, so just keep that in mind all right before I start the, the, the procedure of pulling out the stinger uh, and while I'm waiting for my wife, uh, I just wanted to show you, you know, whenever you find that stinger in your tank, like I said many, many times, take it out, right? Um, you see, everywhere I go, all my tanks, I have stingers sitting around all over the place, uh, practically every single tank. Um, and I'm going to show you guys here. Let's see here. See, I got stinger sitting there. See, I see it in the tank. I just take a nap. I yank it out, and um, I just leave it there. And then, uh, when I get a chance, I'll, I'll collect them all up, and then um, I will, you know, I have this little tray full of stingers. You see, every single tank. I'm always finding stingers all over the place. Look here, I got more stingers right here. You see that? It's everywhere, and. Um, yeah, that's a albino stinger. <laughs> the skin is yellow. Uh, these are from black rays, right? Um, so I collect them all up, and uh, <laughs> I have this uh, little thing where I keep all the stingers. It's always very interesting. Um, people like to see the stingers. They think it's pretty cool. And here it is. Over the years, my whole collection of stingers. Look at this one. This one's practically the length of my hand. It's from one of my bigger rays. It's a whole basket. Here's another big one. Right? Okay. Pretty cool, right? But for those of you uh, who have kids at home, uh, please do not leave the stingers laying around. You know, they, they find it and they think it's interesting. They think it's a toy and it's very dangerous. You do not want your child or, or if you have animals, uh, dogs, cats, you know, they might find their way to it. And if they poke themselves or, 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 or put it in their mouth, you're gonna have a big problem, all right? So stay safe, stingrays, you know, they're called stingrays for a reason. It is dangerous, that stinger is dangerous. You can get hurt from it, all right? So exercise caution when you find these barbs, dispose of them properly, and uh, don't leave it laying around where somebody can get hurt, all right? Stay safe. All right, guys. Um, I got the stuff that I think I will need to do this and I'm going to make my first attempt. I'm going to try to do it in the tank without taking the fish out. So we'll see how this goes. Uh, she's scared and I don't want to startle her too much because the more that she slams up against the wall, that stinger is going to go further and further in. So I have to be really delicate about this. I know this is going to be hard to do. I got to get her up against the wall first. And she probably won't stay still for me. Okay. 
that hand. I got a keeper like this. Tiffany, come around to this side. You're going to try to get underneath that. Are you guys getting this? Mm-hmm. Here we go. You see? Yes. I got it. I'm going to pull slowly. Oh. Nope, I lost it. Almost got it. At least she's staying still for me. Maybe. Ah, I can't uh. get it. All right. So I don't have a strong enough grip. I'm going to have to try this. Hopefully, she doesn't whip her tail around on me. I'm going to be really careful. There we go. I got a grip on it. There yeah, we go. You Look got at that. that. went a lot smoother than I thought it would be. Uh, I'm grateful that she stayed still for me. I was worried that she was going to panic and thrash, but because she stayed still for me, uh, probably she was in pain. Even though she didn't look like she was in pain, um, I was able to get it out. Look at that. Alright, so word of caution, always, always pull out the stingers from your tank whenever you see it because something like this can happen and you're going to lose your rate from it all right thank you guys all for watching please like share subscribe help me grow my youtube channel all right thank you guys